Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Tonight I am doing an unboxing video of the haunted doll Hope. Her name is Hope and she has a whole backstory on Hope. But tonight I am doing a little short video, just a quick uh, opening reveal. You and I both together are going to be doing this together. So without further ado, I have one other package. This is Hope the haunted doll okay so she's gonna get opened second but first I have a package thin kind of feels like a DVD not really sure but it says fragile fragile <laughs> so let's open up this one and I believe this one came from Scott and so did the haunted doll hope Hope came from Scott as well. But first, we're going to open up the small one first because y'all know I like to keep the big ones last. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, I have the trusty knife, the little pentagram knife. Thank you, thank you, Bob. Love you. Thank you for this. So let's go ahead and let's crack this baby open. What is in here? I don't rip it too much because it'll rip it all out. Okay, maybe I'll just have to rip it. <laughs> I'm just scared that I'm actually going to rip whatever is actually inside. So let me open it up just by hand without using the knife. Okay. Okay. Okay, so there's <laughs> there's another one that says do not cut. You see that? Do not cut. Open carefully. Okay. And there's a note. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to read you this. <laughs> okay, so it says Straight Jacket says, thank you, thank you, thank you. The crew at Straight Jacket, because I clearly need one, <laughs> would like to thank you for your kind business and also invite you to cruise the numerous listings in our eBay store. Not only to see the numerous styles of bumper stickers and decals we have available. I have a feeling this is stickers. <laughs> but also to check out our famous artwork that makes unique and inexpensive gifts at the holidays. Most everybody has family and friends who love movies, music, sports, or other pop culture phenomena. Thus, our artwork caters to a wide range of interests, especially at Christmas. Just let us, let us know if we can assist you any further, and we hope to see you again soon. Straight Jacket Staff. Gotta check that out. That is cute. I think I need to cut him out and put him on my refrigerator. So, let's get this puppy dog open. It says do not cut, but I'm not sure how I'm going to open it without gently taking the knife and just doing one of these numbers. See? That opened up gently. Okay, we won't do that side, but this side is kind of taped. Here it comes. Protected by haunted dolls. <laughs> I love it. Thank you, Scott. Oh my God, that is so cool. I love this. I believe it's a bumper sticker, or maybe I could just put it on my windows, be like to the house, you know, so everybody don't come in here because they will fuck you up. Just saying. Okay, let's get opening to hope. Okay, so here is hope. Hope is in this. Box. I'm not going to show you where it came from, but it did come from uh, any, I believe is Nebraska, I think. I'm not really sure. I, I haven't looked at a map for a hot minute, <laughs> but I could be wrong. <laughs> 
So let's not show her address and let's go ahead and get her opened. <laughs> Now she's got a whole backstory. Like she is supposed to be this seven-year-old spirit that is full of hope and joy and playful and happy. And we're gonna see. from Scott. Yay! And I lost my nail today, guys. <laughs> it's been a long day. It's been a long week. Paper! Bubbles! Bubbles! Paper! Oh, here she is. Here she is. Oh, my God. Oh! All right. She does have like a weird, like a kind of like a house smell. Okay, so let's let's unwrap her on camera. Yeah, she's got like a like a antique type house smell. Look at her. Oh, she's pretty. What do you think, guys? What do you think? Oh, I don't think I, I could just feel the face on um, Clarabelle right now, and she does not look happy. <laughs> Should insert a shot of Clarabelle. Oh my God! Yeah, she's got like a either that or she's been like in storage or something. She's definitely um, not a brand new doll. She's been around. So yeah, her, uh, her, she is like, uh, what do you call it, bisque or something? I don't know if that's China. Is her eyes closed? No, her eyes don't close. But she does have the curls. So you know what she kind of reminds me of is, um, whatever happened to baby Jane. Like, I've written a letter to daddy. <laughs> She kind of reminds me of that. And I think she likes that. <laughs> I feel like she's smiling. Ooh, I don't want to bend her arms. I feel like her arm is going to give way. Kind of something moved when I moved her arm. So I think, yeah, everything's kind of attached there. So her arms aren't technically bendable. But she is really cute. And her name is Hope. And she has a complete backstory. So what do you think, guys? Leave a message in the comment down below. Let me know your thoughts, your opinion on Hope. Do you, what, what's, your, what's your feelings of her? Do you think she's like haunted, evil? Does she sit? She stands. She doesn't really sit. I don't think she sits. She doesn't really sit, not like uh, Clarabelle. So she's gonna have to stand. Well, she's definitely pretty. Oh my God, my mom would totally love her again too. Totally. So yes, I should have pulled up the whole backstory of Hope, but she is the seven-year-old spirit and she's playful and orbs come around her and she brings nothing but joy and happiness into your life. All the things that I need. And you can hear her little feet pitter-patting across the floor. But she so reminds me of whatever happened to Baby Jane. <laughs> I think it's the bow and the hair and the golden hair. Yeah, you know, if she had that dress, I'm going to have to pull that movie up. Just that clip. <laughs> Yay! So, my third haunted doll, considering after Charlie started acting cray-cray, which Charlie is right there. You see? And Clarabelle is over here. Let, let me show you Clarabelle. And she does not look happy. She does not look happy. <laughs> um, so I will probably stand her up here by the fireplace. Maybe by my um, 
Evil Dead book. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna maybe uh, stand her up there so she'll have her little spot. Um, and then eventually all the haunted dolls are gonna be in one location, like all together. Like my Dibby box is over there. I got Clarabelle here, I got the clown here. So now I've got her, so she's gonna have to go here um, by the fireplace until I find like either a stand or, well I don't know if I wanna bring in another stand, I've got too much. I've got a wine rack that I don't even have one bottle of wine. Can you believe that guys? I have a wine rack that has no wine at all. That's what I need to do is buy at least one bottle and put it in there. <laughs> but yeah, so we are definitely going to do the spirit box with her. I'll probably work with her a little bit before I conform everybody together. And I swear to God, something just touched me on my knee right now. I thought it was Phoenix, but Phoenix is on my bed and I have the hallway door shut so he can't like come out and jump over and knock everything over um but I feel like something just literally just touched me on my knee right now um so yeah so with that said leave a comment down below let me know what your thoughts are what your opinion is do you feel like she's like super duper haunted what is your feelings because you guys read things really freaking good and amazing so I'm gonna sit her down. Thank you so much, Scott, for the second haunted doll. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Big shout out, loves to you, Scott. Super duper love you. Thank you so much. And thank you for the amazing bumper sticker warning protected by haunted dolls. <laughs> yes, because you know it. Hey guys, I'm gonna sign out, like this video, even if you thumbs down it. I know somebody's like thumbs downing all the video, which it doesn't really matter because that is called engagement and YouTube just loves engagement. So whether you thumbs up, thumbs down, it really doesn't matter to me. I could care less because guess what? It's brownie points for me. The more you give me a thumbs down. So thumbs down if you wish, if you, if you really like think I suck and I'm a bad human being, which I'm not. So with that said, Thank you to my new subscribers. Thank you to my OGs. You know who you are. You've been there since day one. I love you so, so, so very much. Soon, hopefully soon, we will get to a thousand subscribers so I can start going live again, doing my Sunday live. I miss those, so, but I have to get to a thousand. YouTube cut it. Has to have a thousand subscribers before you can go live. And that's what I want to do again. And if you're not yet subscribed and you're watching this video, what are you waiting for? Smash! the subscribe button down below. I even like threw my hair. Smash it. <laughs> oh my God. I'm like, Whoa. Smash that subscribe button down below. You know the drill guys. And turn on the bell for notifications so you know these videos are coming out. <laughs> oh my God. It's been a long day. I'm tired. Ah. Alrighty. I love you. I thank you. And until the next time, peace.